lot. Uh, let's talk about um, Andre. How great was that story last night? That was amazing. Yeah. You know, I think that from social media and everything like that, you know, that's one of the real things that why you love basketball. You know, things like that. First game, and he he killed it. You know, he really did. So awesome. what about the idea of the fact that he was in the G League and D League for, mm -hmm. what, 10 years? 10 years. And so now he finally made it. Does that give you any type of inspiration just as a as an athlete? I think I think for sure. I think that, you know, no matter what your goal is, you never you never forget it. You never give up on it because 10 years later, you what can still happen? make it. Right. Yeah. Marcel, still hope for you. Uh, yeah. I mean, look, I hate to be the heartless one up here, but oh, let's just be real. Oh, like, like, be real about this. Like, the one thing I love about sports is it's a meritocracy. Okay. You, you could get the black hand and the white hand in there. You could get Don't the get rich the and the poor hand in oh, there. Thought, you could get the good the, and the bad, and we're going to figure this out on the court. I love the story, but the athlete in me is sitting there saying, this ain't a perfect story. A perfect story is when wow. you don't even have to go to the G League. A perfect story is when you get there from day one and hit the ground running. Come on, y'all. I get it. We're pouring syrup on this to make this some good pancakes. Pouring syrup. We're pouring You're syrup on it right now. You're but this, this is not the best story that we've heard. And he's not even the biggest star in L.A. Stop with that. Get out of here. Yeah, he is. I understand, you know, your need to, you know, justify stealing money from, like, Dallas. <laughs> and stuff like that. That's, only those two teams. That's, that's all of them. That's that's only those two. That's a perfect that's story a perfect there. Story. Thank you. That's a better story than this. But here's the how deal. How I stole millions. <laughs> when you realize how little money he was making Respect. for that decade. Exactly. And to never give up. Exactly. Out there last night looking like Don Cheeto with he basketball shorts. <laughs> getting them buckets. Yeah. Getting Yo. them buckets. But no, you know what he was money got to do with this? He was a math tutor. He was a coach. He did all these other stuff. He raised his hand also to be in the G League. He raised his hand to play no, basketball, no, ain't it? never Hold gave on. up. Hold this is what I'll say. As a guy with those backgrounds, he was a seventh round D League draft pick. That's now, he wasn't league. even one of the best D League exactly. players, right? So for G League or D League? Where are you going? It's whatever it's called. Right. Right. The Gray League. So, yeah, right. yeah, right. yeah, right. The Gray League. That's the G League. But Marcellus, here's where if it just ended with him signing that contract, then I'm with you about it's syrupy, it's your know, athlete compete meritocracy. But he went and he played against the best team in the league. Yes. Right? The uh, by record. Yeah. One of the best defenses. And Respect. he lit them up. Oh, yeah. and that's the part, yeah. and that's the part that's amazing. Marcellus, all Marcellus if, I walked in, if I walked in the office with this as a Disney script about a guy who's in the minor leagues for 10 years, oh who gets God. called up and scores right 19 down. against the best team in the league, you'd be like, that is so unrealistic, throw it away. I understand. But, but here's the best part of that, too. Mm -hmm. He didn't have a miracle game. Dude shot 50% from three last season. He shoots 48% from three this season. Oh, he's he, he, no, he, he had a miracle. Up by he actually a, playing his game. But he, it was still a miracle you game. You need a heart. You need a heart. All that said, y'all better fall. Tonight. <laughs> Fall in love with the story right now because it's going to end tonight. They play the Clippers, it's a wrap. Oh you know how God. that's going to go. No you ring, no problem.